Welcome to another episode of the Crazy Fisherman UK. Today I'm going to show you my homemade mix I use for the ground bait. Um, it's basically basically ingredients: uh, bread, uh, poi oats from Aldi, etc., etc. So let me show you what I do. Okay, let's make a start. One bucket needed. Um, what I started off with, right? Just for example, is the bread, dried up bread. Crunch it down. You, what you do, you dry it out on a radiator or in the window, okay? Doesn't matter if it's lumpy. Uh, she's gonna kill me, I'm making a mess. <laughs> I'll tidy up afterwards. Anyway, you can make it as large as, as you want or as small as you want, okay? Anyway, I've got some prepared already. I'll show you what I've got. Uh, say for example in here um, this is what I've been collecting over the winter months I've got three bags um, mostly bread a uh, few carp pellets um, also I got some banana bread also dried up on the uh, windowsill or radiator and also Tesco mashed potato um, that's the main ingredients so let's tip it all in. What I want to use, that's probably what I need for tomorrow's session. You prepare this the night before. Okay, and let's put the mashed potato in. The mashed potato, I think, helps to bind the ground bait together. Okay, and I'll just give it a quick mix. So I've also got um, porridge oats in there. I bought a bag from, what was it, Aldi, for less than a pound. There you are. Right. Okay, um, I bought some water. It's hot now. I've let it cool down. So I'm now going to give it some flavouring. So, chocolate. I'll put four of these. You can, you can choose whatever you want and um, for your own flavouring. You don't have to use this. You can use even use strawberry jam and also one tablespoon of coffee so it's my mocha mix okay the lid will not go back on it will now and some sugar i'll put two of them in and uh, roughly a teaspoon of salt and extra sweetness, maple syrup. Just chuck it in. Oops, I used a bit too much. Never mind, it's a bit less for the pancakes. So let's stir all that in now. I should have done this when really it was boiled straight away, but I'm showing you guys and girls what I do. Okay. <laughs> it's a bit lumpy. A bit like my gravy. That's it. Okay. And I'll just pour it in. Wow, I'm making a mess. <laughs> uh, 
that. I'm just mixing it all together now. Getting a nice consistency. As you can see, that uh, mashed potato mix is making a difference. It is binding it. And I think that's about ready now. So here we are, if we get a little bit together into a ball. And that will now break up nicely on the bottom. Yeah, I got two smaller ones there. And that's it. So there you have it. Um, one tub ready for tomorrow. And uh, let's just open up again. That's what I got. That should be enough for a day's session. And that's it. So um, please watch me other videos. Subscribe, like and share. And uh, until next time, um, goodbye.